Hello everybody, it's Torin here from Wupar Gaming, and today I am giving you a tutorial on how to use and install Levelcraft, the leveling up plugin that adds skills to Minecraft. This is developed by Sam Pio, and I'm helping him develop it along with MB Superstar One. Me and MB Superstar add the levels, Sam Pio deals with the core. So let me just give you a brief explanation of Levelcraft. What Levelcraft does is it adds levels to Minecraft, obviously and it restricts you from using certain tools until you've leveled up to that level. Um, destroying specific blocks in that level gives you set experience, you can customise the experience, you can customise what level you unlock the tools. It's very, 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 very good and there's levels being updated daily. So, it was about version 2.6 I think until uh, Samco decided to make the whole plugin lightweight stop it lagging the server because you couldn't have um, Levelcraft and say another high end plugin like Minecraft Mania you couldn't have both of those running on the same server because they just use up so much of the resources so what Samco did is he made Levelcraft Core and that is well, obviously the core of Minecraft, it's the thing that keeps it together it handles all the commands and data storage, it's just very 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 well done and Samco did a very good job so download the core, which is version 0 0.1, and you'll uh, <clears throat> take, take it to a download link from GitHub. Get the Levelcraft jar. I'll get it now. Uh, my downloads folder is very full. So let me just cut that. Go down to my desktop. Where is my thing? It is plugin shop. Here we go. <clears throat> let me get rid of the, the ones already in there. Deep the Levelcraft Core because I don't need that at the moment. Right, so what you want to do is you just want to paste the Levelcraft Core jar in there. At the moment, you've you've got the plugin, but you haven't got any levels, so you've got the core of it. So you know, if you just wanted to live with that, you wouldn't have any levels. And I'm just going to explain the levels here. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You've got eight levels at the moment. Ever since Sam Kev changed it from the core. So we've got mining, which is what it says, restricts you from using like a diamond pickaxe if you're only level one. Uh, description is there. The mining level depicts the usage of a mighty pickaxe. Players living up by mining blocks and enable them to gain access to new pickaxe and new blocks. We've got wood cutting, which is the same but with trees, obviously. Combat, which is PvP with a sword. Range with an arrow. Dexterity. This is something. This is pretty good. Um, depending on the the boots you put on and how. Uh, you can run fast in a higher level, I think you can jump higher, in, jump higher in a higher level, I'm not too sure, I haven't tried that one out. Farming, this one was made by me. Um, you get experience for tilling land, uh, destroying, or not destroying crops, harvesting crops, uh, planting saplings, passing flowers, destroying cacti, and placing cacti. So, you know, so it's a pretty good one. We've got excavation, which is also made by me, which is anything to do with a shovel and items that get destroyed with a shovel and we've got a new one here a unique one made by MB Superstar one which is swimming depending on the helmet you put on it really depends on how much air you can have underwater and it's like a scuba diving gear which is pretty awesome and I'm probably just going to show you how to install the mining one because it's a lot easier I'm not going to go through all of them because they're just the same all you have to do is press download yep press that get your jar file so where's my mining ones here? Drag it into your plugins file underneath level craft. It actually doesn't matter where it is in order, but just put it in the plugins folder. So once you've done that, you're gonna to want to start your server up. And mine's up here because I've got a shortcut because it's easier to do that. And what it should say once everything's loaded up is level mining loaded. And well, there's no uh, permissions, so I get given admin commands for the operator. It's just say level craft core loaded, loaded levels, mining. If all of that's loaded, then everything is perfectly fine, and all you have to do is log on to your Minecraft server and, uh, well, obviously, try using one of the pickaxes, and you'll either be restricted or you'll be allowed to do it and gain an experience. So I'm going to log on to my Minecraft account, and I'm going to show you the commands, what it does, and everything like that. Okay guys, I'm back, I had to change my recording because Camtasia doesn't let me record my Minecraft for some reason. Um, I'm in my testing world, as you see, there's a tilled land, that's where I was testing farming, all the trees have had the leaves ripped off because I was testing if the apple drop worked. Um, I'm going to show you how to use level uh, Levelcraft, you just type level, 
you get a list of commands. So let's do level list shows the active stats. And my active level is mining. If you type level notify, that will notify you whenever you get experience. So whenever you mine something, for example, if you're using the mining level, you will get spammed with you gained you know, like one XP whenever you destroy cobblestone. And you can turn that off as well. So you know, let's do level notify to turn it off. Do level M shows level statistics because I'm using mining as M. Let's do level unlocks M. That shows the current unlock you are on, which is what I found kind of cool is the couple. Yeah, the current level unlock you're on is highlighted in green. The rest is highlighted in red, which obviously you're not on yet. Let's do level exp m and this gets all the data from the config files and it shows you how much experience you get for mining certain ores so oh it's raining now that's kind of cool for example uh, if you're mining obsidian you get 200 experience for it if you're mining sandstone you get free experience for it and all of those experience levels are completely customizable which is what is great about level craft is you can customize anything so let's press the level again because I forgot most of the commands. Let's do next one is level shout m. This is if you want to show off your fancy mining level. X torrents mining level is one. So shout your mining level to everyone. And if say you got like a level 100, you know it's kind of cool to show it off. Uh, next one is level total. Level total shows you your total level in mining and your total experience. And my highest level at the moment is mining, obviously, because that's the only level I've got installed, so it wouldn't differ. And finally, just do level wall, and that shows you all of the mining. Oh, yeah, no, sorry, all of the levels that are installed and the current level you are on it. And now, a recent feature is the admin commands. You do level admin. And here you have well a long list of the administration commands. You can do level admin set level. You have to do the reference level, so mining is M. Do a player name, X torrent, and let's set a level for myself. So let's set a level of 50. And level six successfully, so let's do level M. And my mining level is now level 50 with mining experience of about 48,000. So that's pretty cool. Uh, another one is level admin set exp level reference. Oh, I did put set exp set exp level reference m player name x torrent and this what this will do. Is you can set exp for someone, so it's kind of like setting a level, but setting the exp will we can just give them like one xp. So let's do that, and it will give me one experience point. Uh, another one level admin get exp level reference. Fet, I can't type today. Get no, exp level reference m play name x torrent, and that gets the mining experience for me, and I've got one. So next off, admin gets the level level reference m x torrent gets the level, and some up oh, there you go. X torrent's mining level is one. Level admin. Reset level reference M player name X torrent, and this will reset my mining level. There you go. So let's go and do level M. There you go. My complete mining level has been reset. Um, and if we do level admin, it just shows this again. So that's been the commands. I'm just gonna uh, show you how it works. If I give myself a diamond pickaxe. Where is that going on? I've never seen rain. Well, I have seen rain before. I just haven't seen it properly. Oh, I'm going to go dig right there. Anyway. It's a bit of a lagger. Okay, right. Do level notify. Oh! What the hell? <laughs> Laggy server. Right. If we try breaking this, it shouldn't work because I'm not high enough level. There you go. Cannot use this tool required level 30. And as I said, all of that is completely customizable. You can say unlock the diamond pickaxe at what level three, level whatever level you want. So this has been Torrent from Wooper Gaming, one of the developers for Levelcraft. Uh, I'd like to thank you for watching this tutorial. And if you have any requests on what you want me to do a tutorial again on Levelcraft, like how to do the configs, um, by all means, just send me a message. So thank you guys for watching, 
and have fun with living up on Levelcraft. I'll see you later. Enjoy the rain.